the components required for this experiment are node mcu board node mcu breakout board or you can use a breadboard four channel relay connecting wires connecting cable and four bulbs Now go to the website thingesp.siddesh.me. You need to log into the website if you already registered. If not, just create a new account. Click on the login button. Enter the username and password and click login. Here go to your projects. Here select add new project and create a new project. Enter the project name. I am giving the name as home automation. And in the project device credentials, I am giving us track trends. So the same thing we need to enter in the program. This is the project name. So here we need to enter the project name and this is the project device credentials. And this is the username. Username is also tech trends. Now click submit. Now the project is created successfully. Click OK. Note this endpoint URL. Now go to twilio.com website. Here click login. Here enter the email address. Click continue. And here we need to enter the password. Click the continue button. Now click this icon and here select view all accounts. Here create a new account. I am giving the name as home automation. Here select Twilio and click continue. The country is India. Here select create a new account. So here select the country,
and enter the phone number. Here click send verification code. We need to enter the verification code here. And click submit button. Here what do you plan to build with? So here select other. Which Twilio product are you here, here to use? So here select WhatsApp. And here select hobby star student. And how do you want to build with Twilio? Here we need to select with no code at all. What is your goal today? Here select something else. And click the button get started with Twilio. Now here go to this messaging menu and under try it out select send a WhatsApp message. Here acknowledge this one click confirm button so that the sandbox will be activated. Now here go to sandbox settings so in this place we need to copy this endpoint URL from thingesp.this.me and paste here. Then click on the save button. Now go to the sandbox menu. So here we got a contact number and also a code. You need to save this contact number in your mobile and open that contact in WhatsApp and type this code and send this, uh, send this code. After that, we can check the output. Now we need to upload the program. Connect your Node MCU board to your laptop. Go to this drop down, select the port, and select the board as Node MC 1.0. Click OK. Now click this upload button and upload the program. Now the program is successfully uploaded to the Node MCU board. Now we can check the output through the WhatsApp board. I have saved the number which I got from the Tiddly website here. I gave the contact name as WhatsApp bot. So now we need to type the code which we got from Twilio. And click on the send button. Now the bot is ready. Now we can check the output.